Hi guys, welcome back to METV. So I'm back with another planner video. I always feel the need to explain that this is not a planner channel. This is a channel where I share tips, tricks, and resources with small businesses and direct sellers. But one of my most powerful weapons in my business is my planner. So um, it's my secret weapon to keep me um, an organized business owner. So what I do is um, beautifully decorated planners and I'll give you an example in case you're new and you've never seen one of my videos before. Um, this is just, I'll give you just a quick run through of my January which is getting really full. But there it is. Um, it doesn't all fit in the frame but just to give you an example of how I decorated and these decorations and basically I use my planner as a to-do list by the way um, I try to keep it in some semblance of an order but overall it really is just a giant to-do list but it keeps me motivated it keeps me focused I always remember to come back and check my stuff off because my planner is so beautiful I just want to look at it so in today's video, I am going to show you um, an order that I got on Zulily because the by the time I found this, it was no longer in stores. This is the Happy Planner box. And I think there's one that comes out every season. So be on the lookout. You can go on their website. They're always completely different. This one is from last year. It is by Teresa Collins. Teresa Collins designs are my favorite. It just kind of speaks to me. It's very kind of, to me, it's kind of shabby chic and floral and I love it. So um, I don't even remember if I opened this. I don't think I did. Oh my gosh. Okay, we need to open it together now. Okay, so like I think I mentioned, I ordered this, um, oh my gosh, like forever ago. So I don't even remember what's in it, but I can see right here from the side that um, there's some extra stuff aside from the planner. Oh my gosh. So let's get to it. Oh, that was easy. Okay. Oh my gosh, I forgot about this. And what the heck is this? Okay. Let me relax and go through it. So um, whenever you order one of the Happy Planner boxes, you get, um, like I said, it's a whole kit. Um, they're all completely different, but you always do get a card. This one says Happy Planner and Teresa Collins. By the way, don't quote me, but I've heard that Teresa Collins planners can be found at Office Max. So maybe they have like some deal with her there, but you can't use a Michael's coupons there. So it's going to cost more, but my God, her stuff is so beautiful that it might be worth it to you. So right here, it says you are magic. Here's all the things you need to shine bright this year. All of these designs are exclusive to the happy to the be happy box. All right. So here's all the stuff that it includes. I'm not even going to look at the box because, um, I don't want to ruin my own surprise. So the first thing, obviously, right off the bat is this cutie little bag. You can put your pencils in here, markers, washi tape. Uh, this could be basically part of your travel kit whenever you go from your office to your living room or even from home on a trip and you want to take your planner supplies. Here's your cute box uh, bag. It's so pretty uh, and high. You can never have too many cute bags, right? And right here on the back, it's engraved. It says, um, the happy planner. I love details. I gotta tell you guys, like the stitching, the material, this thing's like really good quality. So that's not too shabby. All right, the next thing that's included are these uh, puffy stickers. It includes 32 of them. Obviously, the color theme for this box is pink and black and white which is perfect because I love those colors these are very cute um, I love the floral I mean hi how can you go wrong these are adorable okay washi as if I need any more washi but who doesn't need more washi so we get three thin washies and there they are so there you go you can see the pattern down there. The pink one says, be you, be brave, 
be bold and then there's the floral and the black washi says I am enough I am enough basically I am enough but I love the fact that these two have like a um, gold element to the design very very pretty okay so here we have a envelope you know what you guys um, if you watched my other planner video I think I showed that I made one on my own um, let me show you guys my planner on the outside there it is and I created one out of leftover scrapbook paper I mean it's nowhere near as pretty as that um, but here it is I just used scrapbook paper and um, some washi tape and that way I had like an envelope to put my stuff but this one is gorgeous by the way if you want to see the video on this planner I am linking it down below but it's very pretty I just love the pattern I love I always love combinations of stripes and florals and polka dots my mom makes fun of me because half of my wardrobe has polka, polka dots and it's already stamped so that it will fit your happy planner um what is this <gasps> don't even tell me this is a sticker <gasps> oh my god it's a sticker book okay so here it is i'm gonna have to go through this sticker book like page by page so you can see the stickers so for now i'm gonna put it to the side and i'm gonna go through the rest but don't worry i won't forget i'm gonna come back and show you uh -huh, the pretty stickers that are in there okay so here are now these aren't um punched so that it will fit your planner so this must be just kind of like a list pad. Um, so it says get it done. And then in this space it says goals, things to do. Ah, that's annoying. You're kind of looking at it through this plastic and the ring light is reflecting. There we go. Okay, so goals, things to do, notes, and then the days of the week. Oh my gosh, it's so pretty and so elegant. I love it. These pages are punched. You would write your main focus, your most important things, something that you are grateful for, and then it has an agenda with um, the days, the times of the day. So you really, I guess, I guess you could even make or purchase more pages um, that are. That would coordinate with these and yeah I guess you really could turn it into a planner I don't know but these are obviously extra pages because here's the planner and it's already filled so let's show you that next changed my mind I'm gonna go through what's here so I can clear my desk and then show you the planner and the sticker book so it comes with these large um, decals so they're like cling stickers so I suppose you could use them in your planner but you could actually use them on your file cabinet on your window um, your car if, if that speaks to you so this says I am enough be you not them and then this large one says don't just wake up and think about the woman you want to become wake up and be her okay let's see what's in this big box because um, I don't remember. <laughs> oh my gosh, you guys! Shut the front door. Like, I need another coffee mug. I absolutely do not. But I'm so happy to have one though. Oh my gosh, I love it. It's all the perfect colors. I love it. And this one says, this is a reminder that you can handle whatever this week throws at you. <gasps> Shut up. I love it. Okay, if you don't follow me on Instagram, Follow me there. I'll have a link down below and maybe it'll appear, pop up here somewhere on the screen. Follow me on Instagram. I kind of have an obsession with coffee mugs and I'm always posting my coffee mug of the day on my Instagram. <laughs> I don't know what it is with coffee, but um, I think if you work at a desk, coffee ends up becoming your best friend. But anyway, look how cute it is. I just love it and it feels excellent it's nice and big oh yeah you guys i'm gonna be drinking a boatload of coffee off of this 
Okay, I'm back. I've cleared off my desk and I, um, the other big box and the small box that you saw on the camera were just filler boxes. So I'm going to go ahead and flip through this Teresa Collins sticker book that came with, so it's not like a subscription box, so you don't have to worry about you know, signing up and then every single month having to, or sorry, every, qu every quarter having to pay for a new one. It's really a sign up as you go. If you see one that you like, sign up. But I will say, if you see one that you like, definitely sign up early. These boxes go so quickly. I could not get my hands on this one. Uh, I saw a YouTuber post it and then by the time I went on there, it was gone. Um, if that ever happens to you and there's one that you really want, um, just go to websites like um, Zulily, that's where I go. A lot of people will go to Mercury, I think that's how you pronounce it. Oh, that's pretty with all the foil. Um, and then I've even heard of OfferUp. And then on Facebook, you know, depending on what planner you have, if you have Happy Planner or Heidi Swap or the Recollections Planner, whatever planner you have, I would search in Facebook for groups for that planner. And um, you can join that group. Oh, I love all these little washi strips. Um, you can join... Hi, how simple. Just love it. Um, you can join that group and they'll... Oh my God, there's always going to be an abundance of ideas that people share, photos of their spreads, and people will usually... Um, post things that they want to sell or swap. I've even seen people like that buy get a book like this and they tear out just the pages that they want to keep and they'll sell the rest like you know two for 50 cents or something like that. Uh, I'm definitely keeping every single one of these stickers because I don't think I could love them more. I don't think I've ever loved a collection more. This is definitely my, my style. I love these to-dos and focus stickers. I love that. Noted and goals. Oh my gosh, this cannot be more perfect. And then these are awesome because you can lay these on your planner and um, check them off. It becomes your to-do list. I love it. Okay, so there you go. And on the back, this kit. Um, so every happy planner typically has um, a screenshot of all the stickers that are inside. Okay, and now for the grand finale, here it is, the Teresa Collins Goal Planner. Oh my gosh, it's so gorgeous. I literally do not remember what's inside these pages, so it's as much of a surprise to me as it is to you. But I love the sleek, elegant um, cover. It's a stay focused and, a, and extra sparkly. I love that. And then it's got the matte gold rings. Okay, so let's see what's inside. Oh my gosh, I already love the dividers. So yeah, definitely it is just a goal because a goal planner because there's only four tabs. But this first tab says radiate positivity. The second tab says the secret to having all is knowing that you already do. This is a wreath and it says be kind. And the fourth one is never, never, never give up. Yep, I agree. All right, so let's flip through the pages. I'm sure they're all the same in each section, but we're just, we'll verify. Okay, so it has an area up here where you write the date and then goals for this week. And it's kind of like a graph. I don't know if you can see that. That's a little better. Um, and then goals for this week. One area I would like to thrive in. Little things that bring me joy. I love that. You can never have enough gratitude and you can never live in enough gratitude. If, if you don't have a gratitude journal, go ahead and get one. It will literally just change your mindset. Um, 
And then down below it says simple ways I can be a leader, uh, be, sorry, be kinder to others. And then down here, this last one is intentions for this week. Okay, on the other side, it is just kind of a uh, page with dots. I use pages like this a lot of times to draw out my vision board. Um, I'm just not into the whole cutting the magazine type of thing, so I'll draw it out and then write notes um, beside it uh, to keep me inspired. All right, on day two, uh, sorry, on page two, again with a date, feeling, and then blank space so you can write out how you're feeling. Over here in this graph area, there's two prompts. What empowered me today? And one thing I'm feeling positive about today. Then in the watercolor, what, <laughs> okay, start over and speak English. Then in the watercolor area, it says today's highlight which made me smile, and today's silver lining, how could it be improved? And then down here, once again, space for your daily gratitude. Um, this is a mirror image of that page. Let's see, feeling, feeling, these are all the same. Okay, these are all... Wait, are they the same? No, they're not. So, this one was what empowered me today, one thing I'm feeling positive about today. On, another, on the next day, it's how did I take charge today and how I showed kindness today. Here's another prompt, how was I loved today? Um, and write an encouraging message to yourself. How was I courageous today? The people who make me happy include, and then you would write down their names. How was I helpful today? One solution to a challenge today. What encouraged me today? I added to my happiness today by, so as you can see, it is very much, it's a prompted journal. So I thought it was a goal journal. I mean, I suppose it could be, right? Um, I believe that you have to live in gratitude and focus um, and a little bit of self-reflection does not hurt in order to achieve your goals and really realize success in your life. So this can definitely be used as a goal uh, planner. Now that I'm looking at it, I don't know if I'll use it, use it as a goal planner. I, this might be my next grateful journal. I have one right now. Um, but this might be the next one, I'm not sure. You can also use this page to um, print out pictures of your family, your kids, um, your week, and kind of pin them here. And then, not only does this become a guided journal, but it is also a memory keeper. So, um, once we keep going, you can see that they do start repeating. Okay, let's see what's in tab two. Tab two is the same. So it's basically, I would say, four months of guided journal. They do repeat. And of course, you can always add these to your day, making it your journal slash memory keeper slash agenda to-do list. I mean, this, if you're not the kind of person that needs the whole shebang with the month at a view, uh, sorry, month at a glance, and then each day laid out, this might be perfect for you. I've heard a lot of people say that they don't use up their, their planners because they just don't write in it every day. Um, this, there's no reason why this planner couldn't last you a year or more. With these pages, if that's how you plan, then you use these and these, turn it into a to-do list, and um, and then only add new pages as you check off and complete your pages. Okay, you guys, that was a quick unboxing and initial reaction 
to the Teresa Collins Happy Planner box. Like I said, this box is a year old. It's just, I ordered it well after it came out and then it sat in a, the box in my office until now. So if I ever get one of these, I am definitely going to film it earlier so that if you fall in love with it, you can um, purchase it yourself. But just know that if you go to the Happy Planner website um, or follow them on Instagram, YouTube, or Facebook, they will notify you whenever their next Happy Box is coming out. And there's always YouTubers that do unboxings just like this one. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, let me know if you did in the comments. Let me know how much you love this planner. If you did, what was your favorite part? Or did you just fall in love with all of it like I did? Um, oh, I forgot to put my mug in the cute little picture. I have to add it. Oh my gosh. Yeah, there you go. Now my picture is complete. Um, there you go. Now my picture is complete. All right, you guys. Thanks so much for watching. Remember to comment below. Let me know if um, you love this collection as much as I did. And if you did, which part? Or are you just crazed by all of it like I am? Um, yeah, let me know. I want to know. All my links are in the description box down below. Make sure to connect with me on Instagram and or Facebook. I do have a private group. It's called Stick to Business. I'll link it below. It's a very, very, very small group, but it's a great way to connect with me on a more personal level because I'm on there all the time. And since it's so small, um, I kind of gotten to know everybody that's in there. Um, so yeah, if you want to join me there and you love planners as much as I do, I'll leave the link down below. Thanks so much for watching, you guys. Um, I appreciate any thumbs up that you give, and I will see you in the next video. Bye.